What is going on, Grade A Army? My name is Brandon with Grade A Brandon. I am here to tell you today that we got something really cool in the works. I was talking around with one of my wife's friends and explaining what I do on this channel, what I'm trying to accomplish. And she says, oh, hey, I have an old card collection. I haven't looked through it all. I'd be totally down if you want to go through and see if anything's worth anything. So that's what we're going to be doing today, guys. We're going to be looking through this old school collection. Um, she says most of it's vintage. And I took a quick look through it and I see some EXs, I see some E-series. So basically this video is just going to be going through and I'm going to pull out anything that I think is worth a fair amount. And then we can look those over, take a closer look at them because heaven knows some of these vintage cards and older cards are harder to find nowadays. Uh, but yeah, let's see if there's anything worthwhile and I'm sure she'll be ecstatic if we find something worth a lot. Alright, let's start off with just a first chunk. Alright, so let's go through here. And I'm going to drive myself crazy because I'm going to have to look up prices and all these and edit them in. All right, so this is Team Rocket Attacks. Is this one? I think in English. Look at that swirl right there. Oh, guys, the swirl hunter in me is kind of geeking out a little bit. Look at that. Oh, I love that so much. Uh, Dratini. There's a focus band. Oh look, it's the uh, banned Mumu Milk card from the Japanese Neo Genesis. This card was banned because, well, he's sucking on a milk sputter and it looks a little too uncensored. There's Lucky Stadium. Ooh, look at that. Mr. Mime holographic. Uh, first edition Swinum Neo Genesis. We got Team Aqua's Kyogre. That's pretty sick. Uh, Dark Charizard Unlimited. Ooh, look at this Delta Species Holographic Cradley. Oh, first edition Neo Genesis Croconaw. Look at that. That is a fan favorite right there. Oh, too bad it's not for Alligator. Ooh, look at this Hollow Nine Tails. Look at that. Let's see if I can get the sparkles in the camera. Kinda. Oh, man. If you are an old school Pokemon fan and you see those sparkles and you're not kind of freaking out and getting all nostalgic, you need to reevaluate your life because that holographic may be simple, but that is like the highlight. Um, oh, okay, first let's look at the Togetic. Okay, do y'all see the swirl? Okay, um, it looks like it's unlimited, not first edition, but it is Neo Genesis Hollow Togetic, and that swirl just makes me a big fan of it. Oh, okay, so here's the base set to Venusaur. There's the hollow. Looks like it's in decent condition. Um, the centering is a bit off. If you can see that there, it's a bit farther in the, or it's going farther left in this picture. But still, it's a hollow. A hollow, fully evolved starter. Cat. Okay. oh my gosh, look at this. We have Typhlosion EX from Sandstorm, and we have Rayquaza EX. I'm not entirely sure what set this is from, but I do know for a fact that, I mean, they're worth a little bit. Okay, so we are gonna go through a few more cards to see if we can't find something more rare. Um, just to show you guys here before we wrap up. Let's see here. Cause I'd love to go through and find something rare for you guys. Okay, there's Execute, another Croconaw, not first edition this time. Horsey, 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 uh, Horsey, Clamp Pearl, ooh, there's the, the uh, card that goes with the Team Aqua's Kyogre, Team Magma's Groudon. There you guys go. Beautiful card. Um, let's check the back on that real fast. It's actually not bad condition. A little bit of whitening. Um, but yeah. So y'all should see some prices coming up for the more expensive ones. Oh, that one's got some damage on it. So 
if there's anything I'm flipping by that is really worth a fair amount of money, you'll see a nice little comment from me. <laughs> Ooh, first edition Sunkern Neo Genesis. Bulbasaur, Zoot Bass, Greenest Cow. Oh gosh. Uh, Kadabra, Gligar, T Max Crayley, Rayhorn. Ooh, here we go. It is Shadow, it's unlimited, but it is a base set holographic Hitmonchan. Again, those sparkles. Oh, that gets me every time. <laughs> okay, we got Boltoy, Boltoy, T Bone. Sandshrew, Graveler, Sandshrew, let's see here, some more basic limited base set. Um, all right, we have Kangaskhan right here from Jungle. Look at that fossil again. Oh, and that hollow. That is so nice. Uh, Delcaddy. I'm gonna freak out if we end up with like a shining card in here somewhere. Uh, that's a fun promo with Chop. Check that out. <laughs> Chucking stuff left and right. You got a little Dope Duo, Hitmonchan, Voltor, looks like a Pikachu, maybe a Jigglypuff. You got Rhyhorn, Kabuto, and Clado. There's a Polyrath, first edition. Nice. From uh, Neo Revelation. Let's put that over here. Um, what else do we have in here? We have... Oh, Pseudo Widow. I love this card. Uh, mainly just because it looks like he's shaking, you know? Most of the cards that come out today aren't that creative. Alright, let's go through one more round of cards. And then if I find anything crazy... Going through the rest of the collection, I will make sure to add a little video at the end, kind of freaking out. Ooh, guys, just picking this up, look what I found. It's another holographic King of Scone with that hollow. Again, not first edition, um, and it is bent a little bit right there, as you can see, kind of in the video. But it's decent shape, I mean, it's not horrible. I mean, this collection has a little bit of everything, and I love it. Uh, this friend was telling me that her father used to work in Japan for a company, and so he'd go out there and back in May he'd bring back some cards, which, you know, that's pretty sick. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I, I wonder if my dad was in the wrong line of work here. Alright, so running through, we're in the Electric First Edition New Genesis Me. Ooh, look at that. There's the promo. Um, Pokemon Movie, Pikachu. Oh, that's another sick one. Knocking this over, there's too many cards. Okay, anything good? Wait, was that? Yeah, Yellow Chief Pikachu. Uh, there are just so many cards. I mean, again, if you're not getting nostalgic seeing all of these artworks flash by, more Japanese, you're missing out. Is that a first edition? No. Um, and again, oh, look, there's a first edition Neo Revelation. Definitely open up that first edition Neo Revelation pack in the past. Um, no first edition Jungle Spiro. But this should be bringing back some fond memories. All right. Well, let's go through this one last little stack and see if there's anything there. Let's see if we can hit some last stack magic. And again, like I said, if I go through the rest of the set and I find something crazy, I will freak out and let you know. Oh my gosh. Actually, I may have found something. All right, you guys are going to love this little set. Thank you for sticking with me so far. Let's finish this out. Tauros, E-Reader Porygon, Porygon, Firo, Stantler, Dunsparce, Spiro. Alright, we got Geodude, Makuhita, Sudowoodo, Larvitar, Larvitar, Ryan Furret, Machoke. Where is it? Oh, there's a first edition Neo Genesis Cyndaquil. Oh, I love that artwork on the EX Sandstorm Cyndaquil. But look at this, Neo. 
think it's Destiny. I could be wrong. Um, Japanese Kolaba. Uh, where's the card I was looking at? Oh, here it is coming up. You guys ready for this? Look at this. This is a first edition Fossil Ekans. And if I remember right, oh, just kidding. This is totally fake. Look at that. Look at that. It's like printed out and taped. Oh, I wonder if she knows this is a fake card or... <laughs> I was about to say, it kind of looks like a box topper. Okay. Mankey. It's holographic Sceptile from Pop Series 1. Oh, that's beautiful. All of these unknown letters. Oh, I love this unknown J. Okay, well, there's a lot of stuff. Unknown Z. There's a Mewtwo promo. Oh, there is a Southern Islands Lediba. Look at that full art holographic. Oh, it's such a beautiful set. Really hard to find in PSA 10s too. Okay. And just to finish out the video, let's go through these trainer cards. Ooh, holographic fossil, Hitmonlee. No. 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 What? Are you serious? Holy crap. Okay, guys, I had no idea this was in here. Oh my gosh, so this first off, holographic dark dragonite. Let me put that aside because we just found a holographic, not a reverse hollow, the full on holographic crystal golem. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, that's in such good condition. Oh, you guys already know what the thumbnail is going to be. Man, I'm going to have to cut this video short. Okay, I'm going to have to work some movie magic. So if I cut out halfway through moving cards, you know what happened. Okay. Okay, I'm kind of freaking out about that. Reverse Hollow Espeon. Oh! Hollow Neogenesis Meganium. Are you kidding me right now? Oh my god, I'm burying the Charizard. First edition Neogenesis Togepi. Oh! Oh! Oh my gosh, it's the Neo Genesis Japanese Lugia. Oh my gosh, where were all these? Neo Genesis Heracross. Oh my gosh. Oh my heaven. Holy crap, I gotta take a breather, guys. I'm seriously gonna have to cut this down. Oh, look at this Wigglytuff. But we got Eladios EX. Oh, and we got a holographic jump up. Okay, let me double check that last row right there. Because if there's something crazy, I want to make sure you guys are able to see it. Okay, I'm not seeing anything too crazy in there. Just a bunch of energies. I think that's about all it is. Um, wow. Well, obviously, this is the highlight. I just want to say that this... This counts as pulling it, right? I mean, look, I'll probably give her an offer on this. I don't know if she wants to sell them since they're kind of nostalgic for her, but holy crap. Anyways, guys, we just pulled and found a holographic crystal type golem from Sky Ridge. Oh my heck, that's so beautiful. Okay, well, I gotta cut this video before it gets too long. But Grade A Army, this was an awesome find. We found some amazing cards right here. Just pan out over this. I'm glad I got to do this with you guys. I'm glad we got to search through this vintage collection. I'm thankful for my wife's friend who let me uh, look through this and evaluate everything for her and make it into video. Anyways, again guys, I'm freaking out. Probably take me a little while to calm down. But I love y'all and I'm glad we we're able to do this together. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Love y'all.